Whoo. Yo, my bad for not, you know, being consistent in reacting to Church's videos. Um, I know I haven't really been reacting to his vlogs and whatnot uh, as of late. There's a reason for that. We'll get into it. But first, intro. What's good, Creed Squad fam? It is your boy Jason JV saying welcome to another review video. And yes, yes, you did not hear wrong. This will be a review. I did give this one a once over. Now, look, y'all know I love church. You know what I'm saying? In church, if you're watching this, man, hey, shout out to you, bro. Appreciate all the love, all the kindness that you've shown me, you know what I'm saying, recently. Uh, and, but look, just because I love church, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, and I support the dude on his, uh, you know, of course, with his music and his channel and everything. It doesn't mean I'm always going to agree. Now, we'll get into uh, more of why, you know, I didn't react to those videos as this review uh, progresses. So let's go ahead and jump right into this. This video that we're about to review is simply called Gray Brain. I mean, I got the brain emoji with the red X emoji. You know what I'm saying? So let's go ahead and get right into the same thing. But I can hear here. Go. So I've set my phone down <clears throat> for like the past week. Kind of just been in my own world doing what I want to. Painting, drawing, uh, ignoring certain people. Kind of shutting everything off. And man, does it make you realize that it's fucking... People are weird, dude. I know this is kind of contra... And he, he, he's not wrong. And sometimes that's what you gotta do. When shit just gets thick, you know what I mean? And uh, a, a lot of shit be, be, be brewing up, you know what I mean? Sometimes you just gotta, you know, just shut yourself off all the nonsense all the noise and just have that time to yourself you know what i'm saying to decompress to just chill relax you know what i'm saying and find your center you know what i mean nothing wrong with that man anyway contradictory but why do people ask why so much when it comes to the internet people are always just asking why are you doing this why are you there why are you mm -hmm. with them why didn't you do this why are you worried if i answer a particular why question does it change your life or make me change mine? No. It's called a comment section, not a question section for a reason. But if you are asking me a why question, my answer to all of y'all is because, period. That's it. Answering redundant questions that you don't have to answer mm -hmm. is what I call being a gray brain person. Kind of just dull and like falling in line with everybody else and fucking answering the questions the way people want you to answer them. Acting how people expect you to act and do things that people expect you to do. Fuck all that. And honestly, I feel... Facts, man. Facts. I feel him, man. And this is why, see, I'm glad um, I decided to make a change this year in regards and dealing with uh, certain people. You know what I'm saying? Because he's right. I mean, when it comes to like getting certain types of comments in your comment section, I get them all the time. You know what I'm saying? Whether it's trolls or people that are, you know, are, are, are just bugging you with stupid, you know, redundant questions that, you know, does it really matter if you answer the question or not? Bruh, <clears throat> he, he's right. It's not worth worth wasting your time on because at the end of the day, you know, who are these people who feel like, you know, they need to know everything about why it is you do what you do, why you are who you are, the way you are and everything. You know what I'm saying? It's like, <clears throat> dude, who are you? Like, I, I have nothing to prove to you. You know what I'm saying? Like, I'm I'm just doing me. I'm staying in my lane. I'm doing me. I'm doing my thing. You know what I mean? If you, if you can't understand why I, why I do things the way I do, you know what I mean? Then you don't need to be here. Kick rocks. You know what I'm saying? It, it, it kind of takes me back to that, that, that one punk, you know what I mean, who called me a whiner because, oh, you know, I have rules as to how, or I have, you know, because I run a very structured channel you know what i'm saying there's rules that i have you know in regards to my channel standards i have you know I mean for for my channel for my channel you know what i mean um people keep spamming my chat with the same with the same request over and over and, and knowing full well that if you take a second to click on the description it, it tells you there on how to properly um get a certain type of video made from your boy but people choose to ignore that you know what i mean they choose to ignore 
my rules, ignoring my standards. And like I said, when you ignore my channel rules, it's like ignoring the rules to my house. You disrespect my channel. You're disrespecting my channel, whether it's intentional or not. That's what you're doing. You know what I mean? And like I said, it's no different than, you know, disrespecting my house. And yeah, I'm sorry. Y'all. I had to go on a little tangent, but I mean, I'm just saying, like, I get where he's coming from. You get those people who leave these, these dumb BS comments, you know what I mean? And rather than wasting your time, rather than wasting your time, you know what I'm saying, on 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 people who are who have nothing better to do with their lives but to be weird and stupid and whatever, you know what I mean? It's like, just keep it moving, you know what I mean? It's not worth it at the end of the day. But anyway. I feel like being exactly who you want to be and like being different from everyone else in today's age is everyone looks at it as weird or or something's wrong with you or something and like exactly people can't respect you for being you these days they can't respect you for doing you you know what i'm saying and meanwhile you're like well i don't care you know what what you do i don't care how you choose to live life you know what i'm saying i don't care about how you choose to do things i mean it's your life, you know what I'm saying, and you're you, so do you, be you, I have no problem with that, but wh why is it a problem, and why can't you show me that same love and respect in return, you know what I'm saying, it's, people sometimes be walking, talking contradictions, man, let's go. Like the past week of me chilling and like enjoying myself, I've had more people ask me, is everything okay, I've heard more rumors, I've had family members hit me up and be like, hey, I heard so-and-so said you was... You was, you was going down the deep end, are you okay? I'm just like, dude, like, I don't even know how to answer these questions. Like, do you see the background? I'm an artist for a living mm -hmm. when it comes to music. <clears throat> mm -hmm. And I'm in a room with mm -hmm. colorful art that I made all over the wall. Yep. Does that seem sad or depressing to you? And another thing. And, do, and not for nothing, and I'm not saying this because, you know, because he says he watches my stuff. You know what I mean? So, Church, I know you're watching, man. But, dude, your art is some of the dopest art I've seen in my life. And I've told you in the comments section on one of your community posts when you showed your art, dude, you should get, you should submit, you know, your, your stuff to, like, you know, your, your nearest local gallery, art gallery, man. Because, you know, your, your art is fire, my guy. It really is, man. Bruh, let's go. thing I've noticed in the past week, man, when you are the happiest and the most content and enjoying yourself to the maximum, that's when people will try to tear you down and do the most to damage you. Those are mm -hmm. the gray brain people. The slugs of the world. The nasty, slimy, fucking... <laughs> slugs of the world. Like the Johnny Gobble dude. Look at him. What the fuck is he doing? The other dude who gets in his car every day and, and free... Speaking of Johnny Gobble, and I'm glad he mentioned Johnny Gobble, and I really want to explain why I haven't really been reacting to... Um, the latest Johnny Gobble related videos is because look, I'm sick and tired of giving that dude, you know what I'm saying, uh, a platform. You know what I'm saying? I'm sick and tired of putting a spotlight on that dude. You know what I mean? I'm sick and tired of putting spotlight on negativity in general. You know what I'm saying? And look, yeah, I, I have, and plus I already have my fun with Johnny Gobble. You know what I'm saying? I already have my fun with my reactions. You know what I'm saying? M making all y'all laugh with that whole situation. And when he stopped doing videos on Johnny Gobble, I was, I was thinking like, okay, this whole thing's over, we're done, we're moving on. And then I seen that he was making more videos on Johnny Gobble again. I'm like, okay, um, I'm not gonna react to this stuff, and you, you know, you know, because again, I don't want to put, you know, more more spotlight on on that guy. I don't, I don't want, I don't want that guy, you know, on my channel anymore. I don't want his name on. You know anywhere near my channel anymore you know what i mean like i'm done i said my piece I, you know what i mean and i just want to focus on something that, that that's cool you know what i mean dope positive and that's like like you know his art you know what i'm saying talking about church right here i want to focus more on like his music you know what i mean and like and when i saw that he was posting in the community post like his art and stuff i was like okay this is cool this is dope you know what i'm saying this is positive i like this you know what i mean let me see more of this you know what i'm saying but like I said, man, the guy, just like me, he's entitled to do whatever he wants and say whatever he wants. Because again, America, you know what I mean? The Constitution, First Amendment, you know what I mean? Bruh. But yeah. So yeah, that's why I really, I haven't really been paying a whole lot of attention to it. Because look, man, there's already enough negativity going on in our country as it is and in the world as it is. You know what I'm saying? And right now, I just want to focus on, 
you know, other things, you know what I mean? And, and what really what, what, what this channel is supposed to be about, and that's the music, you know what I'm saying? And, uh, you know, I'm working on an EP right now. I have, you know, some songs that I need to wrap up. Um, I've been kind of taking a breather with, with, with music and everything because, you know, I got the second channel now. I got to provide content for the second channel. It's all my gameplay stuff, you know what I mean? So, uh, and the link for the second channel is in the description, by the way. Would, re would really mean the world if you guys can go hit that up, you know what I mean? So you can check out some of my WWE 2K22 gameplays, you know what I'm saying? I'm having a blast, you know what I mean? Because... Video, other than music, video games has always been one of my greatest passions, you know what I mean? So it's nice to have another channel to express myself with another one of my favorite passions, you know what I mean? So that way I don't get burnt out on doing reaction videos here, you know what I mean? And, um, <clears throat> yeah, you know, so it's nice to have a channel where I could do something new, different, you know what I mean? And then, you know, then all of a sudden when, like, and then if I'm not in a mood to do a gameplay video, then I can come back here, you know what I'm saying, and do my, my music-related stuff, whether it's posting my original music or music-based reactions and reviews and whatnot, you know what I'm saying? That's why I've been hitting up uh, Snow, Snow the Product a lot, you know what I mean? Because, uh, you know, again, you know what I mean? I just want to focus on the music, you know, and have, bringing, bringing Snow's music to my channel, it's a nice breath of fresh air, too, and everything, you know? So, yeah. Uh, expect more Snow the Product reactions, by the way. Um, I know you guys were hitting me up in the comments telling me, like, she had dropped a new song. I looked at her channel. Nothing was there. Then I find out after, oh, no, it's not on her channel. It's on another channel. So now I got to look for these new drops that she puts out, that, that she had put out. But anyway, let's go ahead and get back into this. He styles all day about how he hates me. Mm-hmm. What is the point? Mm-hmm. Exactly. And this is why I've been saying too lately. You know what I mean? Like, look, who cares what people think of you? You know what I'm saying? If people are talking about you, you are renting free space in their head. You know what I'm saying? Like, um, I told, and I told church in, in the, in the comments, uh, in, in this video, which we'll get into later on. But, uh, so yeah, I'm, I'm gonna technically be spoiling it, but I'm like, yeah, dude, instead of having people rent free space in your dome, why don't you be the Donald Trump, if you will, in Headspace Real Estate. You know what I'm saying? Like, let these people give you the free space in their heads. You know what I'm saying? While you just do you. You know what I'm saying? Stay in your lane. Do you. You know what I'm saying? Do the things that make you happy. Do the things that make you feel good. Whether it's working on music or whether it's, you know, creating other forms of art like he does. You know what I'm saying? Bruh, I'm just saying. If you, I, I've always said this too, and I will continue to say it because it rings true. You have time to, to to hate on somebody. You have time to be negative. You have more free time on your hands than you deserve. And that's facts. Let's go, church. You're not hurting me. I mean, look what I'm doing. Mm -hmm. Gray brain. So when I see stuff like that, and then I look at the people who are asking me all these crazy, why are you doing this, or why questions... Yeah, it, it makes me want to be to myself because being to myself is way more enjoyable. I feel like some people... Facts, and I get that. Look, some of y'all have been following me since since the previous year and since before that. And if you're still rocking with me to this day, hey, thank you so much. Appreciate y'all. You know what I mean? That means the world. But, I mean, I've been through a lot of shit last year, whether self-inflicted or... Or accidental, you know what I mean? Doesn't matter. I, I went through it, you know what I'm saying? And I've dealt with them accordingly, you know what I'm saying? Um, I tried ignoring the problem. Then I, you know, and for the most part, it was working. But then it got to a point where like, okay, I'm going to address this issue. And then I'm going to be done with it. You know what I'm saying? And that's what I did. And then after that, I was like, okay. I'm done with bullshit. I'm done with negativity. You know what I'm saying? I'm starting to become the thing I've always preached against. You know what I mean? I'm starting to become my own worst enemy. You know what I mean? I'm becoming the thing that I don't like. I was I was I was seeing this happening and I had to had to really stop and take a moment and be like, dude, like what 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 the fuck are you doing? Like this is not what you know the the, the uh, things that you're doing is supposed to be. 
This is not what your music is supposed to be. This is not what your channel is supposed to be. Like, so, who are you? You know what I mean? Like, I felt like I was losing myself. You know what I'm saying? And that's when I, I and that's when it hit me. Like, okay, I need to stop with the nonsense. I need to stop with the bullshit. I need to stop, you know, tripping over what people say about me. I need to stop tripping over what people think of me. Because even though it's about me, it what other people think of me, it's none of my business. You know what I'm saying? Like I said, if you're if you're talking about me, if you're thinking about me, well, you're keeping me relevant to you. You know what I'm saying? You want to give me all this 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 attention, even though you don't like me, you hate me. Well, I mean, that's fine. I mean, whatever. You know what I'm saying? Do you? But uh, yeah, I'm just I'm just done with, with done with the nonsense. You know what I mean? I'm done with negativity. You know what I mean? Because like, like like Snow the product said, you know what I mean? If it ain't cool, if it ain't dope, if it ain't positive. Why give it any attention? But anyway. People are too invested in what others are doing. So when you do that, you end up nothing. You're just dull as fuck. Like, what do you do? Like, somebody asked me yesterday. Exactly. You know what I mean? And like, like I said, too, in, in the in a Snow the Product Reaction video I just did. You know what I mean? When you're... I always wish people to live their best lives. Because when people live their best lives, guess what they don't have time to do? They don't have time to be negative. They don't have time to bring down other people's vibes. You know what I'm saying? They don't have time to be, you know, dragging other people down with them in this misery loves company type of thing. You know what I'm saying? In, the, in, the, in this black abyss, if you will. Uh, it's just, yeah, you know what I mean? It, like I said, there's already enough BS, enough negativity going on in, in, in our country and in, in the world. Why be a contributing member? Anyway. They were like, what do you think about Will Smith smacking Chris Rock? I'm like, uh, I think he smacked Chris Rock. My I said, uh, I think both those guys gave me, you know, uh, a, a, a meme I can use in my videos. <laughs> that was a nice one. Okay. Keep my wife's name out your <laughs> no! ah! You know what I'm saying? <laughs> so... You know, it's gonna help me bring in more views, more, more, more uh, clicks. You know what I'm saying? It's gonna help get my numbers up. So yeah, thanks, fellas. That's what I think. <laughs> my opinion doesn't matter about how I feel about it. It doesn't affect Chris Rock or fucking Will Smith. But that's my point. Mm -hmm. With the internet, there are two people somewhere in the world that hold their opinion of that situation so fucking high that they're right now they're arguing about Will Smith smacking him yeah. in the face. And they've been arguing for probably two days in a... And he's not wrong. I mean, look at all these other content creators that's been putting out content in regards to this whole... To that whole slap heard, slap heard around the world. You know what I'm saying? Like, like it's, this, it's this big thing going on. I mean, I've been getting a lot of, you know, recommended videos from people who I'm subscribed to that are making videos about this. You know, Joe Rogan had a conversation about it. Uh, Review Tech USA, who who I I was gonna watch his video um, before I decided to jump on to uh, make this video. He's talking about it. I think this is like his second video talking about it now. And uh, who else talked about it? Jocko from on his podcast. He talked about it. You know what I'm saying? It's like people are trying to make this thing like 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 it's big. You know what I mean? Joey Diaz talked about it too. You know what I mean? And it's like, dude, who cares, man? Dude slapped another dude because, oh, one dude is a comedian and he made a joke about his wife that has, you know, a hair condition or whatever. And it's like, see, look at now. I'm doing it. You know what I mean? I'm talking about it now. But anyway, so let me go ahead and cut myself off and get back into this. Comment thread. That's fucking crazy. Bottom line, famous, not famous, whatever. The world don't have to know who you are. Mm. You have to know who you are. Facts. Every day, somebody shows people who they're not for fake happiness. So are you going to be sad for real happiness? I'm not. So when it comes to me in my daily life, let the Johnny Gobbles gobble. Exactly. Let the, whatever the other guy's name is, let him get in his car every day and rap about how he hates me. Let everyone say whatever they want about me. Exactly. Exactly. See, me and Church, we be... You know, and that, that 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 same mindset, that same mind frame. You know what I'm saying? Let let people let people hang themselves. Let people shoot themselves in the foot. Let them dig their own grave. 
They have nothing better to do but to be stupid on the internet. You know what I mean? Be negative on the internet. Let them. What damage does it do to me? None. What damage does it do to church? None. What damage does it do to anyone who is on this platform? Or hell, or is, is just a successful person? None. When you respond to negativity, when you respond to bullshit, you're only giving these trolls, these these idiots, you're giving them credibility by responding to them. When you go into defense mode, you're giving what they're doing credibility. Think about that. When you put people that don't like you, that view you in a negative light, in the spotlight, that's not a good look on you. It's not. You know what I'm saying? Bruh. That's why I say let them do that. Because odds are people who do that, you know what what you know what, what they could be potentially doing for you? They could be pushing their traffic towards you. You know what I'm saying? And and people and, and the traffic that they push towards you, there could be a good amount of people who don't even know who you are, and when they see the type of person who you are, they may like who you are better than this person that they left. You know what I'm saying? Be, and be like, yo, I like what this person's all about. Let me rock with this person. I like what they're doing. You know what I'm saying? Oh, they make music? Yo, let me check out their music. Is it dope? Hey, this music's dope. Yeah, I think I'm going to rock with this person. Oh, they also paint? They, they, do, they do art? They do other forms of art? Yo, and that's fire too. Yo, yeah, I'm going to stick around and be over here. You know what I mean? Check out their stuff. You know what I'm saying? Like, sometimes your haters... Be your biggest traffic pushers. You know what I'm saying? Your biggest traffic drivers. They by, You know what I mean? Because, yeah, drama sells, but drama only sells for so long. Think about that. It only sells for so long. And then eventually, people get tired of it. You know what I'm saying? I'm living proof. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, I allow myself to get caught up in bullshit sometimes, but they, they, then guess what? I, got, I get tired of it, and I move on. You know what I'm saying? But I'm trying to get better at that, you know what I mean? I'm try- Like I said, I'm trying not to pay any more attention to negativity, to drama. I don't want to give that any more spotlight, you know what I'm saying, on my channels. You know what I mean? Because I-, I don't have time for that. Because what does that do for me? Nothing. Anyway. It don't matter. And it shouldn't for you either. Mm-hmm. And if you are one of those people, like I used to be, that cares what everybody thinks and cares... You know, if you answer this phone call or if you, you do what this person wants you to or, or you act this way around these people. If you're doing that, bro. And, and, and I'm guilty. Guilty as charged. I used to be that person too. Let me wind this back. Person wants you to or, or you act this way around these people. If you're doing that, bro, you're wasting your time. And the longer you... Facts. Facts. Big, big time waster. Don't do it. You wait to do exactly what you want to do with your life. Mm-hmm. How you want to do it, when you want to do it. The longer you wait, the more you're going to be mad at yourself. Facts. Because once you start doing it, this shit, it feels so damn good. You'll be like, damn, I wish I'd done this fucking 10 years ago. The world don't care what you think. So why do you care what the world thinks? Yo. Yo. And that's deep right there. You know what I'm saying? 100%. You know what I'm saying? The world don't give a shit as to what you think. Why should you give a shit as to what the world thinks of you? Ah, let's go. The other day I drew a shoe. There was a snake. And at 6 o'clock in the morning, <clears throat> Margaret from Idaho wanted to tell me that my drawing sucks. You see, Margaret has a gray brain. And it's really unhealthy to be like Margaret. <laughs> Facts. Facts, man. So yeah, I, re- I went ahead and gave it a like, and yeah, I put in my com- I put my comment here. Say, hey man, brother, life is too short to care what other thinks, what others think. Excuse me. Uh, let it be you that's running free space in them in them gray brain dwellers, not the other way around. Meaning, like I said earlier, let you be the Donald Trump in you know headspace real estate, and don't ever allow the gray brain heads, as he put it. Or anyone, any any negative, toxic human being rent free space in your head. Don't allow that. You know what I'm saying? If anything, let those people 
hang themselves. You know what I'm saying? Bruh. People don't need help digging their own graves. They don't need help hanging themselves. People do people do perfectly fine on their own. They do stupid perfectly fine on their own. You know what I'm saying? And eventually they're going to weed themselves out of the light. You know? So, yeah. Anyways, y'all, as you can tell from all that, I am with this 100%. Y'all are too. Y'all know what to do with the link for the original video. Shout out to my man, Church. You know what I'm saying? Always, always that real homie. You know what I'm saying? And, uh, yeah. Yeah, I really appreciated this video. I think this video was long overdue. I think it was well-deserved. You know what I'm saying? And, uh, yeah. So, yeah, I really, really appreciate my man taking time out of his life to uh, make this video. You know what I mean? Real talk, man. Respect the church. If I was wearing a hat, I'd tip my hat to church. You know what I'm saying? For this one. But yeah, y'all. Uh, as I mentioned, link for the original video will be in the description down below. You're more than welcome to hit that up whenever you like, however as many times as you like. And uh, don't forget, of course, uh, to leave your feedback comment section down below. I look forward to checking out all y'all's feedback as I always do. And also don't forget, of course, check out all the other links in the video description down below. Um, below easy for me to say <laughs> uh in the video description don't forget to check out of course all the other links and uh, if i haven't said it already don't forget to like comment and of course subscribe if you haven't done so already if you're feeling the vibes here you know what i'm saying that would mean the world again all of you who have been rocking me throughout rocking with me throughout the years since i started this thing you know back in uh, i want to say end of 2019 beginning of 2020 thank you all so much those of you who had just who have joined us throughout the years and just recently Hey, thank you all so much. And those of you who are subscribing to me just now, thank you. Thank you from the bottom of my heart. You guys mean the world. You truly are a blessing. A blessing. You truly are a blessing from the big man upstairs. I can't talk to me, man. Like, straight up real talk. For real, for real. You know? So, yeah, y'all. It's your boy, Jason JV. So, y'all take care. Have a blessed one. Catch y'all next one. Peace.